Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today I just wanted to give you guys a little bit more information on welding these supports into place. As Andrew and I were talking, we thought it would be very helpful to let you guys know that this is a very time consuming process. It takes about, uh, I don't know, 45 minutes to an hour for each support. So just keep in mind, it's not going to happen overnight. I know a lot of videos make it seem like it's going to just take you a day. Um, this took us an entire week to complete, if not, maybe even a little longer. kind of hard to tell how tall it is so I'm gonna go stand next to it so you guys can see how freaking tall this bus is now it's crazy today I am priming the metal um, so the metal that is going to be facing the inside of the bus I'm putting just a coat of paint on or primer on um, just as a precaution when we took all the stuff off the bus we noticed there was still a lot of rust on the inside so i'm just priming it just you know to make sure that that doesn't happen again so i used this it's rust-oleum paint only thing is you have to make sure that you keep your metal out of the sun or it'll be too hot to paint As I'm painting these, in my head, I'm like, this is a really weird color for a primer. And so I look at the, <laughs> mind you, I did not pick this primer up, and who picked it up? And the, <laughs> the can says rusty metal primer. I think that's the color. just primer but he picked the color rusty metal instead of just white we'll ask him to see what his thoughts were behind that but i'm over here cracking up about it the whole time i'm painting this i'm like i guarantee you he thought it's primer for rusty metal or maybe that's just what i would have thought so i'm like cracking up about it we'll ask him Let's ask you a question okay okay why did you pick that paint why did I pick it? Yeah. Because the guy told me. Why? <laughs> Is it wrong? No, because in my mind, I was like, he picked the paint because it says rust. Rust. <laughs> it says rusty metal, but that's the color of the paint. Yeah. Oh, I thought you picked it because it was supposed to go on rusty. No, I know it was a color. If <laughs> you live outside in a windy place, um, just know that you're probably going to get a little bit of something on your metal. Um, I, you have to put it in the shade because it gets too hot in the sun. So we put ours under a tree and stuff just kept falling while I was painting, which kind of was a pain in the butt, but it is what it is. So I got it all done. Um, I think one coat's gonna be good. And we don't really care about the color. You're not gonna see it. Um, this is gonna be facing the inside of the bus. So it's not facing out. Um, we are, however, going to paint the outside probably the same color because once the bus is complete, we're going to give it a nice paint job so you're not even going to see any of this anyways. This is just a protection. We decided to use 5x10 sheets of metal. They're 16 gauge. The 5 foot 
height of them is perfect because that's exactly what we needed for our opening and we don't have to really cut them. The only time we have to cut them is for like windows or doors or in the back here it was a little curved so we had to cut it to match that shape but it is a perfect fit for what we need. We found these on Marketplace so we lucked out. I decided to use screws, not rivets, to hang the sheets. <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing. Um, yeah, I decided to use screws. Uh, they're just one-inch self-tapping screws. I had to drill a hole anyway because they were too hard to push in. Um, I'm just a f <laughs> pussy. And like I said earlier, we did plan on painting the outside the same color just to protect it from the rain and any moisture. We don't want it to get rusty. Obviously, that's the whole point of it. So I just went ahead and painted the outside the same color that we painted the inside. Again, it's that Rust-Oleum metal paint. But that's all we did for this weekend. Getting one piece of sheet metal up was a huge accomplishment. Stay tuned for next week where we get every piece of metal up on the bus. That's our goal. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with us. We appreciate it. Make sure to like and subscribe. If you guys have questions, comments, please leave those in the description box below. And we will see you guys next week. Thank you.